Have to take that thing. All their buntings, pushing him to take. And at last, they catch hold of that dog who was in his mouth, that dry bone, and began to cut here and there. And he, that dog became uh, full of injuries and blood began to come here and there. And he was now so much taken by him. And he, he was bound to give up. And he gave up throughout his that bone and quickly taking his tail inside his <laughs> behind her leg, his leg. Inside his And he fell. and he began at one side, one side. And watching that, looking that what is going on. And those one dog at once took that bone and wanted to take some Jews from there, but all dogs, about 13, 14, 15, 20 dogs attacked on to take. So we are like that. Our forefathers, our fathers have taken Jews, nothing in this world, like bone and that dry. Well, in all worldly happinesses, like same. If you ask your forefathers who has become 84 or 90 or 100, are you happy? What you have done in your whole life? No, I am not. Why? Oh, I, can. I have now become old. I cannot taste so many things. If I take anything, I cannot digest. I am now going to die. I am not. But his descendant, his sons and children think that, oh, taking from our fathers and forefathers, now we will be very happy. But saying, nothing, there is nothing. If a man thinks that I will take so much wine, and he is taking so much wine, then what will be? What? He will like man. He will fall in a drain. 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 Very uh, bad drain. And you will think that I am sitting in the throne, very golden. <laughs> I am monarch of all. But dogs will smell that oh, some good smell is coming. And they will come and, it and they test by their tongue and they will wash his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so, this. so there is nothing in all these things. No taste, no juice, nothing in worldly these things. So Prahlad Maharaj is taken. And when her Hirnakarja became very furious, he wanted to kill him. But he could not. He was now thinking, hmm, what should I do? Hmm. I think that a, a death can come from this boy. Hmm. I could not kill him. Kill him. So, I am fearing that something can come from him and I will die. But in the meantime, his very dear sister, Holika. Named Holika came. And he told, My brother, dear brother, why you are so much anxious and worry? Can I help you? No, in this in, in, in this world anyone cannot help you. Oh, I, I can help you. What do you want? I want that my son should be killed. Oh, you want? Oh, very happy. I am very easily I will do. How? I have some benediction. I have done very uh, hard astrologies. And benediction came to me that you will not die, you will not burn in fire. So I know this 
vidya knowledge knowledge i will take that word in fire and he will be but very easy they get him then he began to laugh oh my sister set me oh you yes tomorrow you should arrange very heap of dry roots and then i will take that boy in my lap and i will sit in the fire heap of that wood and some ghee and some burning oil all should be given on the oats and and some fire should be given at once it will go so high flame and in a minute he will be and i will come out of fire all were done and in the morning a very big heap of Oh, dry wood. Dry wood was given, and so much ghee, so much all, all things were given. And she took Pranab. Oh, my nephew, 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 dear nephew, you should come in my yard. I will give you so much milk and everything, and take it. And she sat on the in the midst of dry wood, dry woods, and when she sat easily. taking prahlad maharaj in his lap in her lap at once fire was given in all way all round and very quickly the flames began to go to to uh, sky to, to sparsh her baby want to touch the sky to touch the sky and a big sound was there okay. then all were saying that all oh, they are covered by fire There must be, but Pralad mm, Hirnakashvi was satisfied that his sister will come laughing to me and tell that all oh, everything has been finished. But quickly they saw it. <coughs> Pralad Maharaj is coming from the fire, and his sister was not, never returned, never returned. Come into ashes. She was burned into ashes at once. Then I asked to tell that why, uh, how you said? Oh, when I was sitting there, I saw that my uh, mother, auntie, auntie, has been burned, and anyone came to me and he covered me with, with me like a poker, you know, barf case man, like ice, like ice, and I was. Easily said, but I am I am so worried for my auntie. Aunt, aunt. The sheep was also said. Then it becomes so fearful. What to do? And worry. Then the two gurus told, "Why you are so much worried? We have conquered whole world. We have conquered air, fire, fire all water. Five elements you have." You can fly in the air easily. You can take the thunderbolt also. You can defeat Brahma. You can defeat Indra. Everyone. All day we do this. Why you are? Oh, wait a little, or father, father will come and he will easily solve this problem. And then Pranav was again sent to school. There one day. that two teachers were engaged in how in household works jobs and they told that prahlad you should work like monitor in this country monitor yes. you yes. should school, yes. and see that uh, they should not do any anything <coughs> because the boys are naughty so you should control them i'm just returning and telling him it then what became You should stand up and tell. You should hear very patiently and to follow. Om Gyan Sibiran Darshya Gyan Gyan Sabar Chakshara Mili Tamya Yo Tasmai Sri Guru Deva.
I offer them, we will be young. From early age, we can die in the age of seven, eight, nine, ten, and we cannot be young. And if you are dying, then you will not be old. So old age is, age is never to come for them. So do eat in more. Then, go on. So, right now, when we are very young, we should decide what is the right path to follow. Prahlad Mahal has explained that... Nattap. What is the meaning? What? What is the meaning? Not Oh, can you speak? Not that prayer so ayu parang parayam. Not that ha bindate chemam mukund charanam. Oh, Prem Prayajan? Oh, that Namin Sutta. Quickly. Hare Krishna. Tat Prayasa ma kartabha jatrayu bhaya param natatha bindate chema ma kundha charanam gajam. Prahlad Maharaj is explained, telling his demonic friend, Tat Prayasa ma kartabha, don't do so much effort by which you can lose your age. But if you engage with this energy for Krishna for Hari, then you, your life will be successful and you can gain more. Natat prayasu kar tabya jat ayu vyaparam. You should not be worried for your maintaining life. To be happy. To be with family. To marry. and to support children and guys. And then I will build so much high class of uh, any Sky house. Right. <coughs> then I will make a very beautiful garden. Then very beautiful dogs, strong dogs will be there. <laughs> and I will talk, test everything there. I know that this is to waste time. If sufferings we don't want, but even then it comes sufferings. We want never we want to be old, but oldness will come. We want never sufferings, but sufferings is bound to come by past births impression. So if you have done any job or anything for happiness, it will all come automatically. Everything you are managing of uh, maintaining life, good wife, good children, happiness, everything will come automatically. Why you are doing so all these things? If it automatically sukh will come, like duk, like Misery, everything is coming. So why you are not from beginning chanting remembering? Here is the happiness, not in no. The demonic friend is telling, Oh brother, we shall alive for a long time. No need to start from boyhood. And Prahlad Maharaj is giving a sketch of our lifetime that we are about, our age is about 100 years. I suppose. Suppose we are everyone cannot live here. 100 years. But suppose suppose we live in this world about 100 oh, years. Yes. Among this 100 years, we work in daytime and sleep at night. So half age we spend on sleeping only. So from 100 years, if we cut to half percent, 50 percent that for sleeping. Then only 50 years age is still there. So from 80 to 100, it is too old. You can be straight also. You can digest anything. 
so many diseases. If you want to put your step here, it will go there. And cough, cussing, cough, cough, coughing. Then your daughter in law and other relatives say, oh, why is this old person not going to die? Death is not coming for him. If he dies, it will be better for us. My children cannot sleep at night. Oh, he is coughing always. So many diseases may come. So many infections may come. Oh, better he will die very soon. In this Western world, they go old house. But in Indian culture, they live in their own house. So the daughter in law relatives think if they die, it will be better. <laughs> so from 80 to 100, you cannot, you can, you cannot chant, cannot remember, cannot show on anything. It is beyond conception. So one <coughs> devotee is telling Krishna Tadiya Pada Pankaja Pangaranta Addaya Visatu Manasaraja Hansa Prana Prayana Samai Kavavata Vittai Kanta Padavan Raste Bhayanan Kutaste Devotees pray to Krishna, oh Krishna My mind must be attached in lotus feet just now. Why? If we remember during our day, then Bhakta is telling, oh Krishna, don't cheat me. Prana Prayana Samai Kavavata Vittai Then dealing old age and dealing, especially dealing when we shall expect from this world, then our voice will be choked. We cannot utter your name. We cannot remember. Kanta Bhajanam, Kanta Bhajanam, Taste Bhajanam, Taste. Our voice will be choked. We cannot utter your name. So, our mind will be fixed from today, not today, from just now. So, from 80 to 100, we are unable to chant, unable to remember. So, this 80 to 20, 100, this 20 years is useless. So at first, 50 years spent for sleeping and from 80 to 100, this 20 years for useless time, for useless life. So 50 plus 20 is equal to 70. So 30 years is still there. So in this material world, we want to enjoy so many things. For maintaining our life, we have to be a Great personality, maybe a doctor or a barrister or minister, so many things. So being expert, at least 20 years is needed. So being expert in this material world or enjoying this material world, 20 years is needed. So at first we spend 70 years. 70 plus 20 is 90. So 90 years almost done. So rest is 10 years. In these 10 years, there is uncountable desires. I want beautiful wife. So many sons will become, I have to nourish them. I have to build a house. I have to purchase very good quality of car like Jaguar, so many rose car I have to purchase. So all time will be passed. So, when I shall do bhajan, so Prabhupada is telling, if you start from your boyhood, then impression will come in your mind and heart. Then easily you can progress in Krishna consciousness. If you not do so, then everything will go in vain. When you will go for preaching a harina, if any material person asks you, better you can chant in old age. Then if Prabhupada is telling, no, Oman Vachara Pradko have to start from boyhood. If you not do so, suppose in England there is so many university like Oxford University. If you ask their professor, better they don't teach here. Well, they will be 80 years after that you can give admission then in your university. Is it possible? <laughs> Never is it possible. So if we want to be expert in materially, so we have to start our education from boyhood. But why not this bhajan from boyhood? If we not start bhajan from boyhood, it is not possible for advancing Krishna consciousness. So Prabhupada Maharaj instructs us through demonic friend. 
then we have to start our bhajan from Bible. Then his, that? his friend is telling, Oh brother, don't worry. Better teacher is not here, we can play. Aj karo so kal karo, kal karo so parso, kyao khat khat me pade hai, yeo samay pada hai parso. Oh brother, don't worry so much. Which you instruct us, today we shall do tomorrow. How? Oh, if we instruct tomorrow, we shall do day after tomorrow. Why are you so early? Oh, that's a long time. We will lie for a long time. Don't worry. Pralama is telling, Subhasa Sidram, Oh my brother, your idea is not good. Kao karo so aaj karo, aaj karo so aaj, Pralama pralai hai bahuri kadayi kao. Oh my dear friends, don't worry. Don't be hopeless. I may give you a good suggestion. What do you want to do tomorrow, please do today. And what do you want to suppose to do today, please do immediate. Because none can say when death will come for us. If someone invites you that who will join in this assembly, that 10,000 pounds will be distributed for each. If you think that I shall go after tomorrow, Everybody will run as soon as possible. <laughs> so if we want to progress in Krishna consciousness, we have to be so alert. Then we have not to be delayed for a moment. So Prabhupada is giving the suggestion. And then all of them began to start Kirtan. No, no. Then Prabhupada is suggesting them now you are uh, boys of three, four, five, six, or seven. Only this is very you are like Komarga. Uh, in boy, um, boyhood, uh, boyhood, boyhood, But if now you are so much uh, free from worldly uh, things, and your heart is so much plain not written anything there but when you'll be matured and if you are married then a, a beautiful wife will come and at that time if you will leave this world to do bhajan then she will be how you can give up a very beautiful and um, having so many qualities you cannot give. And if you will have some children, one, two, three, four, some daughters, some sons, very beautiful, then you will be engaged more in them. <coughs> then if you will try to give up all these things, you cannot give up. That, oh, I will have to support these children. Now they are like very baby, they cannot do anything. If I am going, giving up this householdness, then all will die. So, how you can do? If the children shall be father, 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 then, then. then how you can give up all these things? If you have made a very good uh, garden, and so many trees, flowers are there. And if you will decide that I should give up and go to chant and be with the association in bona fide Vaishnavas and chant and remember, how can you give up? Oh my, who will take care of my this garden? All flowers will die. Oh my beautiful dog, he cannot live without me. Oh beautiful cow, beautiful days. You cannot at that time. If you want that, but you cannot. So better in this childhood. childhood, you are free from all these things. Better you should chant and remember from this time. All students, demon boys, were so much. Yeah. But Inspired. 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 
But they have some doubt. They have some doubt. Prahlad? From where you learned all these things? Very high class of Philosophy. philosophical these siddhans. And what you are telling, you are true to Esther. <coughs> so, now we have so much faith on you. But we want to know from where you learn so good explanations and all these things. Then what he replied? You should stand up and tell. You cannot? Pundarik. Pundarik remembers? No, I don't know. You go ahead. You take water and take water and take water. Anyone? You can. And very strong way. We have been associated with Narad anyhow. We have not seen Narad here, here. And you are one year, ten, very little small boy, boy baby. When you got uh, the association of Narad Rishi, then what? Then he explained that when his father, Ramya Kashipu, had left for, um, to perform austerities, that his mother, Kayama, why, why you went to do aesthetics? He went to perform austerities to get home from Lord Brahma. Uh, he saw that my his, brother, his brother, my brother has been killed by Vishnu. So Baraj is not other than Vishnu. And if I am going to take revenge to kill Baraj. Vishnu, then he should surely kill me. So I should be like. Ajar Amar. Immortal. Immortal. So he went. That. So you should explain. So then Raya Kashipu, when he went to um, Mandira Hill to perform his austerities to gain immortality, then at that time the demigods headed by Lord Indra, they, um, they went to, they understood that Kayadu, the wife of Raya Kashipu. You should tell this. When he went to go to astrology, for studies, he left anything to take, even water, even dry leaves, even air, everything he left. For 60,000 years he was in a, in a trance and his body was taken by and plants and <coughs> so only the only bone was there and at that time in Satyaju life he used to live in bone not in this body and he now if he will not take anything after two three days he will die but at that time life he used to live in bones so he was doing doing Started for 60,000 years. And in the meantime, what became? So, in the meantime, the demigods, understanding that his wife was pregnant, so headed by Indra, they went because they were thinking what, that. What he told? Indra. <laughs> so, they were thinking that within the womb of Kayadu, that there was another very big potential demon that was coming. So they went with the intention that they would um, kill the baby that was within yeah. the womb. Mm. So at that time, um, Kayadu, she... Um, she a he attacked with whole soldiers, all demigods. And very big battle was there. The generals of Hiranyakashvi were there, they were fighting. But the demigods can all smash them. Smash them. And at last they catch hold of Kayadu. So then Kayadu, she was uh, calling out for help from Narada Muni. Then Narada Muni, mm -hmm. he, he began to take they, they, his they mother, to take Kayadu. Kayadu, in where? Heavenly planet. Heavenly planet. So that when he, 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 she will be matured in his home, then boy will come and they will. 
so he was taking. In the way Narada was coming from heaven or any planet, told just say, why you are doing so nonsense thing? Being a demigod and you are taking king of demigod. This lady, he cannot fight with you. Why you are taking? Then, then Narada Muni explained to um, the demigods that actually the baby that was within the womb was a great devotee. Um, Lord Indra and the other demigods are thinking that this was a big demon. But Narada Muni explained no, that this is a very, very great devotee. So that you should not um, disturb Kayadu. So then the demigods, understanding the situation, they circumambulated Kayadu pain obeisances to Palat Maharaj and then they departed again for the heavenly planets. But Kayadu, she was feeling still some fear because of this situation. And then she asked Narada Muni um, that she receive shelter from Narada Muni and that also the baby that was within her womb, that he may not, he not be born until um, her husband, Hirani Kashipu, had returned from performing his austerities. So Hirani Kashipu, he performed his austerities, as Maharaj has stated, for 60,000 years, um, just keeping his, the life within the bones. And finally, when he had finished his austerities and asked the benedictions from um, Lord Brahma, then, um, well, in this time, when the austerities were being performed, then, within the hermitage of Narada Muni, Narada Muni was instructing Kayadu in um, spiritual life. He was speaking from different, from so, all different scriptures, from the Upanishads, from the Vedas, um, Puranas, etc. And explaining so much Lila Kata and giving so much Siddhanta. So, Balak Maharaj was within the womb and he was hearing all these instructions and Hari Kata from the lips of Shilanara Muni. So, he also explained that Karmanya Rahmananam Karmanya Rahmananam By karma, but what we are doing, we cannot be happy. Never, never, never. Anyone has not become never happy. Hmm? If you want to be happy in life, Go to very expert guru and at once take initiation, name and everything. And then try to follow the rules and regulations of devotions. Then they told that, oh, it is very hard. We cannot do these things. Then Prahlad Maharaj told, oh, Sarveshanam Bhutanapi, Hari Rat Neshwara Priya. Bhutari Mahadvi Shri Kritai Kurtanam Jiva Sangita. We are eternal servant of God. Eternal servant of Krishna. Krishna is supreme personality of Godhead. So there is nothing uh, hard to, um, to chant, remember, devotional activities. Naturally we can do we should accept that Krishna is our holy master, his father, his mother, his everything. So doing like this, so after going to Gurudev and taking initiation, we should learn how to begin our activities, Uttama Bhakti Fatis. Then he will teach everything. He will tell everything, like Shiksha Guru, everything. And then he will tell that there are Bhakti of um, sixty-four kind. Sixty kinds. kinds of. In them, four, five are prominent. Nine, nine are prominent for Prahlad Maharaj. Shamadam, Kirtanam, Vishnu, Shvaran, all these things. And among them, five are most important. Sadhusam, Nam Kirtan, Bhagavad Shamad, Mathurava, Srimutti, Sadhaya, Shakal, Sadhana, Shrestha, Ebancha. Among all the 
the first nerve. Limbs. Huh? These five are so much prominent. If anyone not doing any offense and is touched by any of the five, hmm? chanting name, being in initiation of any very good qualified guru and Vaishnava, worshipping very Faithful. faithfully and hearing Srimad Bhagavatam. So any of the five, if you you are touched anyhow a little. And among all these things, most important and root of all bhakti is Hari Nam Shankara. Tarmadya Nam Shankara. From today, from just now, we should begin Hari Nam Shankara. They told us that how we can do we, what We should be expert in instruments. No, no, no need, no need at all. We should bring any instrument. No, no, nothing. Bali Krishna has given kartal here in hands. We can do it. Kartal one. And Krishna has given very beautiful tongue and mouth and shrink. Voice. 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 So, we can do from here today, just now. They all agreed that we will follow you. So, then Prahlad Maharaj what doing? Oh, repeat me. Yes, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama. Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram. So we want very easy. Then, oh. then repeat again. Hare Ram, Hare
and frightening and awesome form, a most astonishing form which had never been seen before, which is very, very powerful and white, the body of a man and the head of a lion. He was so big that the hairs of his mane would send it, the airplanes of the demigod spinning into outer space. <laughs> fire was coming from him. His eyes were red like fire, and his tongue was moving about like a dueling sword. How did he have <laughs> He had thousands and thousands of hands, and in his hands he was holding many, many weapons. So. <laughs> Then Hirani Kashipu, seeing uh, uh, Lord Narasimhadev, he thought, whoa, what is this amazing creature? I have never seen anything like this before. And then he took up his sword thinking, actually I have a benediction from Lord Brahma. He cannot be killed. So whoever he is, whatever, whatever he may be, cannot kill me. So he took up his sword and shield and ran at Lord Narasimhadev, exactly like a tiny mosquito goes into a blazing fire. <laughs> so, <laughs> then the fight began. And sometimes, Lord Nisingadev, he would catch uh, Hirani Kashipu in his grip, like this. And at this time, all the demigods who had been living under the fierce tyranny of Hirani Kashipu, they began to cheer, Jai, Jai, Jai. Huh? And then he, when Hirani Kashipu would slip from the grasp of Lord Nishigade, then he would become a rose. Oh no, what will happen to us now? And he became so afraid. So Lord Nishigade, he can very easily kill Hirani Kashipu, but he's playing with him. He's having some um, viri or ras. Previously, uh, Narayan in Vaikuntha, he had this desire in his heart. Huh? I would like to relish this viri or ras, the desire to fight. Hmm? But with whom can I fight? Hmm? Everyone in Vaikuntha, they are all my devotees. They will not fight with me. And if I go to the material world, no one is qualified. Uh, no one can give me a good match. So by the arrangement of Krishna, uh, the Supreme Lord Yoga Maya, the past time took place that the four Kumaras, they went to Vaikuntha and were stopped by Jayan Vijay. And then the four Kumaras, they cursed Jayan Vijay to appear in the world to take birth as demons. So the Supreme Lord's own devotees, they had appeared in this world as Hiranyaksha and Hiranyakashipu. So now, Lord Nisingade was enjoying very much this uh, very harass fighting with Hiranyakashipu. So sometimes he would catch him and sometimes let him slip. Mm -hmm. And another reason that is that all the demigods began to assemble. Yes, that all the demigods were, their hearts were shaking in fear. And then, another reason Lord Nisingade did not immediately kill Hiranyakashipu was because he wanted to keep intact the benedictions given by Lord Brahma. His dear devote, devotee Lord Brahma had given the benediction to Hirani Kashipu that he could not be killed during the day or the night. He could not be killed in the, on the land, in the air, in the sky, in the water. He could not be killed by any uh, creature created by Lord Brahma. He could not be killed by any man or any animal. He could not be killed by any weapon. He could not be killed inside any building or outside of any building. He could not be killed in any year. So, so many benedictions. And having all of these benedictions, Hirani Kashipu was very confident. Yes, now I am immortal. Hmm? But Lord Nishingadev was waiting for that time, the time of dust. It was not in the day and not during the night. And at that exact moment, Hirani, Ka uh, uh, Hirani Kashipu was grasped by Lord Nishingadev. And Lord Nisingha placed him on his lap. So he was neither on the land or in the sea or in the sky. And he was neither inside or outside of the house because Lord Nisingha was sitting with him on his lap in the threshold, in the doorway. <laughs> and uh, Lord Nisingha, he did not kill him with any weapon, but rather just taking his very sharp and pointed nails. He not in any year? Uh, oh, not in any year. This was a leap, leap, the leap year day. So, in this way, all of the uh, words of Lord Brahma, the, the words of a, pure, of a pure devotee, they must prove to be true. And Krishna will always protect the words and the promises of his devotees. So, to keep intact the benedictions of Brahmaji, then Hirani Kashipu, uh, Lord Nishimadev, he killed Hirani Kashipu at this exact time, in this exact way. And he appeared, not in the form of a human being, and not in the form of an animal, but half man and half animal. 
है भाई भी अपियर सत्या विधातुम ये भक्त सभासु तो तो Because you are telling that you should want something, benediction. So I think I don't know where it is hidden here. So please take. 
people say, oh, I know that you are true. You don't want them. You just never will find them. But I still I want something that you have to take to me. Then Prahlad Maharaj told, so that if you are instructed me to take any benediction, then I want that my father has done so much, offended me, offended me, he has given so much uh, trouble to all the devotees here. He has cut all the green trees that anyone cannot uh, have any food or crows. He has killed all the cows that he cannot come, we cannot come, butter cannot come to for devotional activities, for human judge of fire satisfaction. And he has killed all the brandings at that time. So he has done so one very blender mistake of anything. So please uh, for this forgive Think of that of oh your total father. Your father has been because those who are of high class put some by snow in their dynasty, upper and lower, 21 generation, generation, all father, all mothers, all will be there. And those who are in Madhya always chanting, remembering, doing the most of activities, their 14, 14 generation should be quickly. And those who are now Kanishtha Dikari, taking initiation and doing chanting remembering and try to do uh, pure Harinam, pure devotional activity, but they cannot do it. Even seven generations. Uh, so don't mind. Then he could do Again he told, insisted, I want to be any meditation because my darshan is of the going there. So you say, one thing. Then he told, uh, I want that. All the conditioned souls are forgetting me. And they are now doing so many bad things. And they are suffering so much. I cannot tolerate. Right? I want that. My all good things to be given to them so that they may be devoted. I want to take the, all their suffering and bad, fruit of bad activities. And for life and life, but I want to suffer, suffer for them. But they should be devoted. Then the last man I am defeated, the devil. I am defeated. And you have born me. You have born me. Now I am. Myself be giving you this benediction. Anyone hear this Haritapha about myself and this Yoshar, Prahlad, the first time, the first time of Prahlad Maharaj and the Shingi Dev, that will be quickly liberated. And anyone has not to suffer, you will have not to suffer. So, you now, if anyone doing chanting, remembering, wishing to live and Prahlad Maharaj, anyway participating in this function here, in Abhishek, here in Haritatha, this is and powerful Haritatha, all should be liberated by this. If this thing promises this, <laughs> that anyone here, I'll make them but liberated from this one and all their suffering, all of them, everything I can say. So they will not be able You should have a very And gradually, we will develop our Krishna consciousness and he will give inspiration for Bhakti life. So, after this, we will do Abhishek, Abhishek of 
listening to them today first sankirtan and then abhishek nandan who will do like indian fresh not so much tightened by it. coat and everything only halka chadar they should take and do two three persons who will do ragnat bhatta ragnat bhatta Naveen, they can all do. A very simple, he knows, he will show and he will do so. Quickly, take up all your cloths and go there. First take Ashman and do. Two, three persons can help. Uh, Sudan Sakha and Kundari, they will help. And you should also go. Quickly, oh, we should do some Krita. Oh, you should do. On her side, Thank <laughs> you. 
नमो महाबदन्नाय कृष्ण प्रेम प्रदायते कृष्णाय कृष्ण चैतन्य नमन गौर विषे गुरव गौरचंद्राय राधिकाय तदाल कृष्णा कृष्ण भक्ताय तदभक्ता भक्तियाय अपराधलक्ष्य चिता से कामतरंग मध्य कृपा मयि तम शरण प्रपन्ना बृंदे नमस्ते चरण तवैवास्मी तवैवास्मी नीवा तया विना राधे नाम नाम Hold my eyes, this. He should come and take it. Please stand up if your name is mentioned. He should come. This bigger is bigger one is yours. Manohar Lal Prabhu, please stand up. And this another person. Oh. Anyone should come and give. Manohar Lal Prabhu. Where, where is Manohar Lal Prabhu? Today he received diksha. Ah, oh, Manohar Lal. His first name was Manohar. Manohar. Oh, very good name. Manohar Manohar Lal Prabhu ki. Yeah. Very beautiful. Then, Doctor uh, Julian Seal, please stand up. Oh. Julian Seal yourself yourself you oh. oh where is Julian 
Okay, you? No, he's not standing. No. Oh, he's not here. <laughs> not here. <laughs> then second year. Not here. Okay, the name, no problem. No initiation. Only neck beat. No. Or neck beat. What you get in my name? Next. Next one. What's your name? Lee Spalding. Lee Spalding. Over here. You? Yeah. Ah, okay. Lavanga Sakha. Lavanga Sakha. Lavanga Sakha. Lavanga Sakha Prabhu is the one of the most dear friend of Krishna. Lavanga Ujwal, all. So you are best friend of Krishna. Lavanga. Ah. K. Walters. And then K. Walters. She's, she's here? Yeah. Where? There. Oh. Kamala Devi. Oh, Kamala Devi. Very beautiful name of Radhika is Kamala. So, very beautiful and easy name. Kamala Devi Ki. You should remember and write down your names. Then Andrew Wayne Wright. Andrew Wayne Wright. He's here. No. No. Announce his name. Not here. No, yet announce his name, but you will know. Then better his name. Anna Marie Gardener. No. This is whole family, I think. Daniel, yes. It will be his children now. Children? Yeah. No, no, they are not children. No, it's with it. They're with their yeah. children. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel. <laughs> Daniel. Daniel Gizi. They may be his children. Yes. That's his point. That's oh, his point. Yamuna and Yasoda. They, they will come later. <coughs> what name has been given? Okay. You can note it down in your paper. And you should tell and bring. Okay. Andrew Wainwright Abhinandan. Abhinandan. Abhinandan Prabhu. Abhinandan Das. Anu yeah. 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 Marie, yeah. his wife, Aditi. Aditi, Aditi Devi Ki. Yeah. Daniel Kijal. Then the children, Daniel, Gauranga. Gauranga, Gauranga Da. Yeah. And then Yamuna. Yamuna is okay. Yeah. Yasoda. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, that boy has taken initiation. He was he's here. He was sitting here yesterday. Yes. Daniel. Okay. Then Edward Winston Bell. Bill. Very good. <laughs> what name? His name is Ananda. Hmm. Ananda Prabhu. Ananda Prabhu ki jai. <laughs> Of Krishna, Ananda. <coughs> Ananda Das. Ananda Das. Very easy name. Ananda Prabhu, Ananda Das, anything. Paul Smith. <laughs> then Paul Smith. Pallava. 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 Pallava Prabhu ki. Yeah. One of the best friends among the best friends of Krishna. Allah Prabhu. And next, Govinda Charan Didi. Oh, Govinda Nam is okay. Oh, she so wants a new name and you have given a new name, Govinda, Govinda Priya. Priya. Oh, Govinda Priya, the most beloved of Govinda. Yay. Govinda Priya Ki. Then, uh, Shandas. Where is Shandas? Okay, no. <laughs> Not that. He <laughs> slipped. <laughs> then <laughs> Harvey Chitter. Harvey. Oh. Are you here? Here, here. Uh, what name? Harvey. Harvey. What have you given? Halayud. <coughs> Halayud. Name of the Balram is Halayud. Very strong, like Haldhar. Haldhar and Haladi Yudhar 
like shame and you are also like haldhar so halai goodness go halal prabhu jai jani kaso kaso Hmm. Jai Nandini. Jai Nandini. Jai Nandini Devi ki. Then Naomi Smith. Naomi Smith. Oh. Malini. Malini. Oh. Very good name. Malini. Malini Devi ki. Dominica Cherchi Damayanti 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 Devi ki Ho gaya No no Jaldi karo Graham Graham Hutton. Graham Hutton. Here, yeah, here. Yeah. The name is here. Yes, I know. He is here? Yeah. Uh-huh. Gandharva. Gandharva. Very beautiful and very qualified. One of the shakhas of Krishna. Gandharva. And he sings so well and always plays all the shakhas and Krishna. Gandharva Prabhu ki. James Belfield. Oh. Jagat Mohan. Jagat Jeevan. Jagat Jeevan Prabhu ki. Jagat Jeevan. Who is Jagat Jeevan? Krishna is himself. One of the beautiful name of Krishna is Jagat Jeevan. So Jagat Jeevan Prabhu ki. Then Sashi. Stankiya. Stankiya. Oh, she's there in back. So she can talk. Where? Oh, yeah, behind. Hindi, Urdu. Oh, yeah. Hindi, Urdu, Hindi, Urdu. Gujarati. So she can talk. Oh, Shashi, Kalakar, no? So she can talk. Shashi can talk. Shashi can talk is one of the name of Sri Mati Radhika. Beautiful light, more beautiful light, more than moon. So Shashi can talk. He just. Krishna Dasi. Oh, Krishna Dasi is better name. Yes. Oh. Uh, no, no. see you, see you. Uh, go on. Go on, go on, see. It's the only name. <laughs> Gita. Vaidya, daughters of Sudevi. Yeah. Oh. They have received Harinam. Gita and Nodiya, both in same name. Oh, your daughters. What, what name? Gita. Oh, Gita is very good, beautiful. Nadia. Nadia. Very good. Then Anjali. Your your daughters? Anjali is your daughter. Ah. Oh, Anjali. Anjali is very beautiful name. I have nothing to change. Anjali Devi ki. Hari. Oh, Shri Hari. Shri Hari Das. Oh, Shri Hari. Shri Hari Prabhu ki. Shri Hari himself is Krishna. You should always try to remember your names. What? Then Sarup Damodar. Haladhar. Haladhar and Jaya Dvaita. Three. They have all taken Diksha from you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same name. Tomorrow will be first sacrifice. Yes, will be present there. Yeah. And first sacrifice should be arranged from today. Yes. That in morning you can do up till nine ten. Nine. Yeah. Christy Smith. Go on, go on. Kirsty Smith. Who is Christy Smith? Oh, yeah. Karunamai. Karunamai. Karunamai Devi. Karunamai Devi ki jai. Radhika is so merciful. So he is 
monastery name is Mashifu, that is Karunamai. So I'm giving you Karunamai Devi Ki. Mike Young. Mike Young. He's in wheelchair. Oh, your shirt. Uh, what? Makhan Lal. Makhan Lal. Oh, Makhan Lal. Makhan Lal who is always going to st still butter. butter and very jolly friend of Krishna. Makhan Lal. Prabhu Ki. Yeah, yeah.